Hey fans, today I'm going to show you an easy and inexpensive way to make fire starters for uh, campfires or bonfires. Uh, cheap in materials. Basically I've got tubes, these three tubes here are Christmas wrapping rolls I cut into thirds. You can use uh, paper towel rolls, toilet paper rolls, some kind of wax. I've got some paraffin, household paraffin wax here melting down, and shredded paper. And now that my wax is all melted down, I'll show you what I do. Take a tube like this, you're going to put in shredded paper. I have a lot of this lately because we shred everything because of people trying to steal identities. So everything gets shredded and then you're left with a bunch of shredded paper you don't know what to do. So I just stuff the tube shredded paper. Don't pack it too tight otherwise oxygen can't get in there and it burns a lot slower if it burns at all. I just fold the ends a little bit. Try to help hold the paper in. Once that's done, I'm going to dip the ends in my wax. That helps seal it the paper falling out and it also makes it a little easier when you go to start them. To do that I set those off to cool. I also save up the toilet paper roll tube so we can make smaller ones. As you can see, I've got hot wax here. Now I'm using paraffin today. You could use old candles. Uh, even if you use scented candles, they put off a nice smell when you burn them. Uh, be very careful because this stuff is very hot. You can see I've got some tubes already done. Uh, the sandwich plate I found somebody had thrown away, so that didn't cost me anything either. The reason I'm doing this is uh, a lot of people I go camping with do not know how to start a fire. They end up pouring a gallon of gas or lighter fluid or tiki oil on a bunch of wood and try to get it to burn. Like I said, just place these on the bottom of your pit Put your kindling on top of it with your larger wood on top of that and light the end of these and you should have a fire in no time. Stay safe.